My name is Dennis Gichana. I'm the manager in charge of ADC Swam Orchards. Um, this farm was established in 1979 uh, from ADC Japata Complex. Uh, it covers a total area of 2,000 acres. We have got various enterprises, which includes seed maize, citrus, uh, beef, dairy. We are also doing sugarcane and commercial maize. Uh, in citrus, the orchard was established in 1975. Uh, we had a uh, varieties of fruits. We had both, both temperate and the tropical fruits. But over time, the tropical fruits was phased out because of the root rot. We currently have citrus as our major enterprise in the orchard. We have got uh, uh, so many varieties, uh, about 15 of them. Four of them are the uh, lemons and 11 orange varieties. They are planted across the orchard. The orchard alone covers a total area of 350 acres, equivalent to 150, 140 acres, hectares, I mean. Um, in terms of production, we have targeted a total production of 1,255 tons for this year. Uh, our, our major market is from across the country, that is from Nairobi. Some customers come from Mombasa, others come from Kitale and the western side of this country. Uh, in terms of labor, we have employed a lot of labor in the orchard because it's labor intensive. In the orchard alone, per month, we, we have employed 200 casual laborers who are working on a daily basis. In terms of uh, seed maize, we have planted a total area of 500 acres of seed maize. That is, we've, we, we, we work in, in, in contract with Kenya seed. The seed maize is normally taken for processing in Kenya seed. Then uh, for dairy and beef, we have got a total uh, hard size of 240 animals. We have got uh, the brown Swiss and the jersey and the crosses and dairy crosses in dairy. And in beef, we've got uh, the Charolais and the Hereford. They make the enterprise of livestock. So when it comes to citrus, it's our main enterprise here. It covers a total area of 350 acres. Sometimes we do irrigation. In fact, during the dry spell, we normally do irrigation that is to, to ensure that production is continuous across the season. For the previous year, that's the financial, financial year 2021-2022, we achieved a total production of 900 tons. We faced a lot of challenges, especially on, on irrigation. Uh, our main source of water for irrigation is from the Swam River. Sometimes the Swam River dries up and the levels of the water that comes for irrigation goes down. It makes a very big challenge. The orchard has got a potential, a very great potential in terms of production. We can achieve a total production of 5,000 tons in a year. If we are able to do irrigation in time, the orchard also faces a lot of challenges in terms of pests and diseases. The spraying interval for the orchard is normally 30 days. The moment we skip the spraying interval, then all the fruits will drop from the, from the trees, leading to a lot of post-harvest losses. The orchard is also divided into three sections. Where we are here is, the, is known as Jensen, the upper orchard. We have the middle orchard, which is known as Kerio, and the lower orchard, which is the main orchard. This orchard here, the Jensen, covers a total area of 100 acres. The middle orchard covers 50 acres, and the lower orchard covers 200 acres. In total, we have a total area of 350 acres.